protective screen of sandbags covers the spot where a delayed action bomb has fallen outside Buckingham Palace. After the explosion, some hours later, a gaping crater is made between the palace and the Victoria Memorial. By this further deliberate attack on the lives of our King and Queen, when five bombs fell on and around the palace, the home of our beloved sovereign and his consort is again damaged. One bomb crashed through the Queen's drawing room, while others fell in the quadrangle. Within a few yards from where the King and Queen were sheltering, the Royal Chapel was struck. Tearing through the roof, the bomb completely wrecked the altar and hurled 20 tons of debris into the basement. We thank God that their majesties were unhurt. But swift vengeance strikes at the black-hearted raider. A few seconds later, a Nazi plane was seen to break in pieces, crashing within a short distance of Buckingham Palace. Thus ended the murderous attack on what the twisted Nazi mind called a military objective. May this planned attempt at assassination recoil a hundredfold on the beast of Berlin. Thank you.